Welcome to the Shaw Word for today. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, or good night, wherever and whenever you may be listening. Welcome to the Shaw Word for today audio and video daily devotion, brought to you by the Shaw Foundation Transcend Ministries and authored by Jefferson Otenbara Inby. The Shaw Word for today is not just another daily devotion. It's a unique source of daily spiritual nourishment, carefully crafted to inspire, uplift, and guide you through life's twists and turns. Rooted in timeless biblical truths, each devotion is designed to provide comfort, wisdom, and motivation, helping you deepen your connection with God. Whether you're seeking peace, clarity, or strength, you'll find that these messages speak directly to your heart and help you navigate your day. Our mission is to bring hope and light into your life while encouraging you to share that same love and grace with others. By joining this journey, you're not just enriching your spirit, you're becoming a beacon of support for those around you. Your role is crucial in building compassionate communities, and that begins with each one of us embracing the call to be our brother's keeper. So, we invite you to walk this path with us as we work together to foster love, kindness, and connection in a world that needs it now more than ever. Thank you for being part of the The Sure Word for Today family. Let's grow together and be the strength others can lean on. Mental health conditions are often hidden on same struggles that many face. I recall my former boss, an accomplished executive with a medical doctor husband, living a seemingly perfect life, yet she secretly battled nephomania, an uncontrollable sexual compulsion. Unaware of the condition, she turned to faith to suppress her urges but remained bound by a mental health disorder she didn't recognize. In another case, I saw a movie where a young girl was nearly killed by a mob for stealing something trivial. It wasn't about the theft. She suffered from kleptomania, a mental health condition that drove her actions. People around us, our colleagues, friends, and even family may be silently battling these hidden struggles. It's time we shed light on these conditions and offer understanding, compassion, and hope. In my new playlist and series, mental health conditions on the youtube channel the show word for today i will shed light on conditions like this which often go unnoticed people may appear fine on the outside but beneath the surface they carry severe mental health struggles in this series we aim to educate empower and raise awareness about these often misunderstood conditions you will learn about disorders like nephomania kleptomania bipolar disorder, complex post-traumatic stress disorder, and others that have no medical cure but can be managed with understanding, support, and faith. We believe that with the power of God's word, healing is possible. Whether you or a loved one is struggling with a hidden mental health condition, there is hope and restoration in Christ. Subscribe to our channel and our daily devotions to stay informed and inspired. Links are provided below. Be part of this journey to spread awareness and compassion. The Table of Contents The Affirmation Begin your week with a powerful affirmation that sets the tone for the days ahead. These affirmations are carefully crafted to enhance self-awareness, overcome doubts, and foster self-love. Embracing these affirming statements aligns you with your goals and values, nurturing a more profound sense of self-worth and compassion towards others. The title for today's devotion. The title highlights the overarching theme of the weekly series. It provides a general idea of the topic we are discussing and explored in depth throughout the week. The subtitle for today's devotion. The subtitle signifies our approach to presenting weekly topics through a series of seven daily episodes, with each episode corresponding to a specific day of the week. 
it serves as a guide to understanding how we break down and deliver the central theme over the week. The Key Bible Verse Discover the guiding light for the entire series through the Key Bible Verse. Rooted in scripture, this verse serves as a beacon of wisdom and inspiration, anchoring your faith journey. The sure word for today's devotion. Delve into the heart of the devotion, where insights are shared and spiritual guidance is offered. This core message forms the foundation of inspiration, ministry, and fellowship, nurturing your soul and deepening your connection with God. Connect. Bridge scripture with real-life situations, making the message relatable and applicable to your daily experiences. Extend. Explore additional perspectives, scripture references, and historical context to enrich your understanding of the central theme. Reflection and Application. Reflect on the content and consider practical ways to apply the teachings in your daily life, fostering spiritual growth and transformation. Inspirational Quote by Jefferson. Draw inspiration from an uplifting quote by Jefferson Owinby, designed to motivate you and uplift you above life's challenges. Let us pray. Engage in prayer aligned with the day's subtitle, inviting God's presence and guidance into your life as you journey through the devotion. Make a difference by giving. Extend compassion and support by contributing to our mission through an insignificant gesture. Your generosity enables us to continue our impactful work, spreading positivity and making a difference in the lives of others. A final thought with Jefferson. Receive an ultimate message of encouragement and solidarity from Jefferson O. Inby. Jefferson O. Inby concludes the day's series with a powerful motivational message, inspiring you to embark on your week with renewed determination and purpose. The Affirmation The Affirmation for this week's sure word for today. I am moving from darkness into the light, where healing, peace, and hope embrace me. God's unfailing love and strength guide my journey. The title for this series of the sure word for today. The title for this series of the sure word for today's daily audio devotion is From Darkness to Light, A Journey Through Mental Health. This week's series, From Darkness to Light, a journey through mental health, explores the emotional and spiritual battles people face. Through faith, prayer, and support, the series offers hope, healing, and restoration, guiding you from mental struggles to peace in God's light. The subtitle for today's series The subtitle for today's episode of The Sure Word for today's daily audio and video devotion is From Darkness to Light, A Journey Through Mental Health. Part 1. The Key Bible Verse. Today's Bible verse of the sure word for today's audio and video daily devotion is taken from the book of Matthew, chapter 4, reading verse 16. Quote, The people which sat in darkness saw great light, and to them which sat in the region and shadow of death light is sprung up. Unquote. Unless otherwise stated, we read all Bible quotations from the Holy Bible and the King James Version.
The sure word for today's devotion. Recognizing the darkness in your life begins with understanding the subtle signs of mental health struggles. Elijah, after his victory at Mount Carmel, fell into deep despair when Jezebel threatened his life. Though he had just witnessed God's power, his fear and exhaustion pushed him into isolation. Like Elijah, you may feel overwhelmed, withdrawing from those around you. Mental health struggles can often appear as fatigue, lack of motivation, or persistent sadness. These signs are indicators that you are battling a form of darkness. The weight of this darkness affects both your mind and soul. It drains your energy, leaving you feeling hopeless and disconnected from purpose. Elijah felt this burden so profoundly that he asked God to take his life. Darkness can distort your perspective, making it seem like there is no way out. You must understand that these struggles are real and not simply a lack of faith or strength. Recognizing the darkness is the first step towards healing and restoration. The Bible teaches that even in your darkest moments, God's light shines brightest. Elijah experienced God's gentle presence, not through fire or wind, but through a still small voice. This illustrates how God meets you where you are, offering comfort and hope, even when your mind is clouded with fear and despair. Understanding that spiritual darkness is not a permanent state can help you seek the light of God's healing. Connect. Hi, I've experienced seasons of emotional darkness where fear and doubt clouded my heart. The story of Elijah reminds me that even God's most vital servants battled the same struggles. You are not alone. God's light is available to you. Extend The psalmist wrote, quote, Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me, unquote. Psalm 23, verse 4. This scripture reassures you that God's presence is your guide through the darkest valleys, offering peace. Reflection and Application When I recognize the darkness in my life, I can take steps towards healing by seeking support and leaning on God's promises. You too can acknowledge your struggles, trusting that God will lead you into the light as you journey through mental health challenges. Inspirational quote by Jefferson Owen B. Quote, Darkness may cloud your vision, but it never dims your worth. Recognizing the struggle is the first step towards finding the light and reclaiming your purpose. Unquote. Let us pray. Dear Lord, today I recognize the darkness that weighs heavily on my heart. I acknowledge that I cannot walk this journey alone and seek your light to guide me through. Just as you comforted Elijah in his despair, comfort me in my struggles. Please give me the strength to see beyond the shadows and the courage to reach out for help when I need it. Help me remember that no matter how dark it gets, your light is always near. 
thank you for your unwavering love. In Jesus' name, Amen. Make a difference by giving. Thank you for being a part of our community across the Shore Word for today. Start here with Jefferson and Robust Digital Expert. Your support is invaluable to us. By buying us a virtual coffee, you're helping us continue to produce content that inspires, educates, and empowers, making a difference in the lives of others. Together, we can make a difference and reach even more people. Thank you for your generosity and for believing in our mission. Make a difference today by clicking the link in the description. A final thought with Jefferson. Life is not just a string of coincidences. Things don't just happen randomly. Every situation, every challenge and every triumph comes for a reason and in its own time. You might be facing tough times right now wondering why things are happening the way they are. It will feel like everything is working against you, like you are stuck or life is unfair. But let me assure you, this is not the end of your story. Though you may not understand it now, know that there is a purpose in your struggle. Every difficult moment is shaping you, building resilience and preparing you for what's ahead. It might not feel like it at the moment, but these experiences are refining you, making you stronger and wiser. Trust the journey. Even when things seem uncertain or overwhelming, believe that they are working in your favor. Sometimes. The most significant growth comes from the most difficult challenges. You may not see it today, but in time, the pieces will come together and you will understand why it had to happen this way. Keep your faith strong, your heart steady, and your mind focused. You are being prepared for something more significant and everything will work out for your good in the end. Look forward to my new upcoming series in our new playlist, Mental Health Conditions. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, The Sure Word for Today, and click the notification bell to be alerted when the new series premieres. Stay tuned.